University life is awesome. You can join a club, start a club, go to Isaacs on Thursdays, play on sports teams, and subscribe to Brock TV. Plus, with all the spare time on your hands, there's so much room for living a spontaneous lifestyle. But what's the point of living such an awesome university life if you don't have anyone to share it with? For our Brock Bachelor and the contestants on the show, their journey to find love starts right now. Hey, I'm Caleb Bradley. I'm in my third year of sport management and I'm from Ancaster, Ontario. I'm uh, very excited to be on this journey. Um, I think it's long overdue that I found a girlfriend, so I thought there was no better place than the Brock Bachelor. Yes, my, uh, my parents, my whole family actually knows that I'm on the show and I'll uh, do my best not to embarrass them too much. Uh, at the end of this experience, I'm hoping to find the uh, the girl I'm ready to spend the rest of my life with. Uh, when, I'm, when I'm looking for a girl, I, I love somebody who has a love for life and a meaning for life and somebody not just going through the motions. Somebody who's organized and responsible like me, but also is uh, able to have a good time and enjoy life. The things I strive to achieve at Brock are collecting as many wristbands from the cage as I can, finding a high table in market, and finding a seat on floor five of the library when it's midterm and exam season. What in the world? Hi. Hi. I'm Rima. Nice to meet you, Rima. Nice to meet you. I'm Caleb. I hope you choose me as the leaner for Brock Bachelor. <laughs> I don't know what to say. Thanks, I'll see you in there. Um, honestly, I don't know if it's a leg up. I just wanted to show my true personality. I'm a real jokester and I just like to have a good time all the time. How are you? Good. I'm a hugger. I couldn't hug her. She had a hot dog on. How are you? I'm good. How are you? Good. You look great. Thank you. I'm excited to get to know you. Thank you. Nice to hear that from someone other than my mom. Hello. How are you? I'm good. I feel like I know you. I brought you a little something. This Thank is for you. you to uh, drown out I don't the midterm drink, blues. Thank you. Oh, I got you a midterm drink. tomorrow. So it's nice go. to meet you. Nice to meet you as well. I'm Courtney. Thank you. Nice to meet you. I'm Caleb. Nice to meet you, Caleb. Um, I hope that it helped me stand out. I, I think he likes drinking based on uh, the gauge I got from the reaction. But I think that uh, maybe he'll help remember me a little bit more when he's enjoying a cold one after. Hi. I'm Jamie. Nice to, nice meet, to you. meet you. I'm Caleb. How are you? Good, how are you? Good, are you excited? I'm, I'm pumped. That's good. How are you? Yeah. Good. All right. Good, I nice. can't wait to get to know you. What was your name? Jamie. Jamie. Hi. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you? I'm good, thanks. I'm Caleb. Nice to meet you, I'm Irina. Nice to meet you. Are you excited? I'm so excited, how are you feeling? I'm good. I'm a little bit nervous, but... I'm feeling better now, so. That's good. I hope everyone's been super friendly. Too. Everyone has been. I'm really excited to go on this adventure with you. I am too. I'm looking forward to getting to know you. I'm looking forward to getting to meet awesome. you too. Know you too. Hi. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. I'm Nicole. Nice to meet you, Nicole. I'm Caleb. Hi, nice to meet you. Are you excited? I'm so excited. Good, yeah. so am I. See ya. Honestly, I accidentally told him nice to meet him three times when I first met him so he probably thinks I'm a bit crazy but um, I don't know all these girls are a lot older than me so hopefully me as a first year I stand out I'll do what I can and yeah how are you Kennedy <laughs> good it's nice to meet you for the honestly hundredth <laughs> time are you oh excited gosh. yeah I'm kind of nervous yeah, so am I. The lights kind of make it scary. But, yeah. You know, it's okay. fine after a couple. Nice to see you again. Okay, so my friends, when I first told them that I was going to apply, they were like, OMG, you should totally do it. Like, I literally told everybody that I was applying, and everyone's like, you totally should, because I'm like, whatever, like, dramatic and outgoing. So I think that they're, like, psyched, and, like, I haven't told any of them. So, like, when they see this, they're going to be like, OMG, like, I can't believe you actually, like, 
are on the show. Hi. Hello. How are you? Good, how are nice you? to meet you too. I'm Monica. Monica, are you from Ancaster? Yeah. Okay, I thought I recognized you. Oh. I'm from Ancaster too. <laughs> oh, no way. Yeah. I have a treat for you. Thank I'm you. Italian. Should I open it like, now? Yeah. I can only have eyes for you. <laughs> That's right, it's nice of you to say before you even saw me, but <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. hopefully I uh, didn't disappoint. I'm not going to eat it because it's just going to ruin the mic yeah, and I'll yeah, look yeah. funny, but I will eat it's those tonight. Mountain. Are they? Yeah. Oh, okay, well, I've never had cannoli, so I'll there have to go. try them out. Well, you know All right, well, it's All nice right. to meet you. Nice to meet you too. Hi. <laughs> How are you? Good. Good. It's good to see you. Me too. How's are you going? excited? Good. Yeah, so am I. Yeah. We're in the same boat. I don't blame you. I'll talk to you more inside. Yeah, see you. <laughs> well, I actually know Caleb from first year, so like I've met him a few times before, so uh, I was nervous coming into it, but seeing that it was him, I was kind of relieved some stress, I guess. Hey. Hi, how are you? Good, how are you doing? Good, thanks. I'm, I'm Caleb. Marissa. Nice to meet you. I'm on the women's hockey team. Oh, are you? I am, so I brought you a stick. All right, I played hockey back in my day. Oh, did you? I did, yeah. I started getting bonus points. Okay. So, ready? Yeah. Okay. So, if you give me a rose and keep me around, I'm going to show you that I'm oh. <laughs> that I'm good for more than just a one timer. Wow. Yeah. Awesome. Very Great nice. line. It was nice to meet you. <laughs> nice meeting you too. I'll talk to you more inside. <laughs> Good. Good. Nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet What's you. What's my sister's name? Oh, really? Then you're yes. used to saying it, I guess. I'm used to saying it a lot. Usually for bad reasons, but. Oh, okay. Well. Maybe we can change that. Yeah. I better reasons now? Yeah. Awesome. Just kidding. Victoria. <laughs> it was nice to meet you. Nice I'll to meet talk to you more inside. All right, Caleb. So you've just met some of Brock's finest bachelorettes. Anyone stand out tonight? Any really interesting first impressions made on you? Um. I got cannoli and I got a six pack of beer, so um, I've never got those two things in the okay. same night. Um, also a girl who said she didn't want to be a one timer, which is, which is nice. It shows that their, uh, their intentions are in the right place. Um, and a couple, couple girls that I'm friends with that I've never really thought about <laughs> getting in a relationship with, so it'll be interesting to see how that goes. All right, so this is your moment, your night. The girls are obviously very anxiously waiting for you inside. Uh, all the best. Thanks, Matt. You're welcome. Good luck. Here he comes. Hi, guys. Hi. Hello. How's everyone? Good. How are you? I'm good. Thank you. So why don't you start by telling us about yourself? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Oh. Matt, trying to figure out what year you're in, what program? I'm in third year. Okay. And a lot of people think I'm in child and youth studies because I'm minoring in it, but I'm not. Okay. It was a, a bit of a mistake that I <laughs> chose to do in first year, so. I'm about two courses away from finishing that and can't really do anything about it now. So, But I am in sport management, and um, my name is Caleb. A lot of people think it's Kale. It's going pretty good. Everyone's pretty nice. He seems like a really nice guy, so that's about it, yeah. You went to Ancaster, right? Yeah. Yeah, okay, I was supposed to go to Ancaster. Where did you go? I went to a private school. I'm not rich, but like, no, no, no. But um, yeah, I like to uh, I like to play sports. I'm on three intramural teams right now. I'm trying to win a t-shirt. Um, yeah, I, I wasn't good enough to make any professional sport team, so see ya. Not impressive enough. Um, wasn't good enough to. Thank you. Yeah, I'm super nervous right now, which is weird because I usually don't get nervous, but um, I don't know. It's kind of a different mood. <laughs> it's a different scene. I'm used to the bar scene. Um, and I got a picture with a cool NHL player named Tyler Sagan. I don't know if Woo anyone knows him. I lived yeah. on the same floor with him last year. <laughs> not, no, 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 like, not, not Tyler. that Tyler Sagan. <laughs> <laughs> like, he's an NHL player. We need that, we need that. <laughs> Are you a hockey fan? I am. Who's your favorite team? Uh, probably the Maple Leafs. Ah, I don't yeah. like to be cliche. Cool. Um, we are on a group date, and I've never been on a group date before. I prefer monogamy, but you know, there's a first time for everything, and I'll just give her a go and see how it goes from here. Uh, I think this is a good time to uh, crack this non-alcoholic <laughs> champagne here. <laughs> that I hope there's not a cork on. What about you guys? Switch the question. What do you guys like to do? What are your favorite? hobbies and goals and aspirations. <laughs> to make enough money to provide for all the dogs I'm going to have. I'm 
day. You're a dog person? Big dog person. Do you have any dogs right now? Honestly, like, if I was him, I'd be so nervous because, like, he's meeting, like, 11 girls. Um, but I feel like he's, like, adapting to it well, so he's doing better than I feel like I'm doing right now, but I don't know. I mean, I'm blushing a little bit. I would say yes. He's really cute and nice, and we were talking about traveling before. He seems to have a big passion for it, and so do I. So let's see if we have chemistry. Ready? I want to make <laughs> enough money to Thank travel you. the whole world. <coughs> I want to go to every single country in the world. Have you been anywhere so far? I've been to probably about 30 different countries. Whoa. Oh, wow. Oh, my oh. gosh. Big traveler. That Huge my, like, traveler. Four. I thought four was a lot. Uh, I mean, we can bump that up. I guess not. Yeah. <laughs> What's the coolest place you've been? Thank you, my friend. Uh, Isaac Fern Grill. <laughs> For sure. Isaac Fern Grill. Yeah, sorry. Oh, I was not. Friend zoned already. Sorry. Big. Big. Oh, my gosh. Huge. Oh, Isaac. Yeah. 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 Caleb, I'm sorry. It's okay. No, everyone seems really cool. Um, we've all gotten along really well. Um, we've all talked for a little bit, and everyone seems really nice. Yeah, we're all getting along. Like, when we were down there and talking and stuff, like, everyone seemed, like, really outgoing, and everyone was just laughing and having a good time. So, yeah. <laughs> cool. Oh, I'm sorry. I thought, <laughs> thought you were accounted for. I thought you just drank it really quick. I, I, know, I know. I know. I know. It's fine. So... I'm interested to see how tonight's gonna go, but there's only a few roses, so could be me going home. No love. Pardon? Oh, okay. I do. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yep. Like that, so um, I was there this morning, and I don't even know what it's called. I don't know. We can go to church together. If you want. <laughs> yeah. <we can>. yeah. <laughs> first date. Maybe. First date to church. Yeah, I like it. It's an ideal first date. <laughs> what do I like? I want the track <laughs> team at Brock, so that's fun. I like cool. did that summer training a lot and then i worked at nick master for uh, like teaching kids sports cool. that's fun yeah he's really nice he's like really down to earth and like he talks about his family a lot so that's really good because i think family morals are important and he plays lots of sports which is cool because i like playing sports too is everyone excited for halloween oh my <laughs> i'm so what's excited. everyone being i'd really like to know i'm going as kiss with my roommates um me and my roommates are doing jersey shore what are you what are you being Kennedy? Um so the one night my friend and I are gonna be a nurse. Just whatever. <laughs> and then the other night's actually been decided, like it's kind of stressful. Still up out. in the air. Yeah. Honestly, I think I definitely do stand out. I mean, I'm just like so like free, fun and spirited, and I feel like that is what Caleb needs. Also, um, I think I'm the only one here who works at the campus store. So, I mean, I can, he can get my discount. Like, it's 20% off. So, I definitely think that I do stand out. <laughs> do all your parents know you're on the show? No. <laughs> your family? No. no. And even my grandparents know. And they're, they, can't, they can't wait for episode one. So, yeah, that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> the very non-awkward first impression, Rose. Um, there are definitely some strong personalities. The hot dog was uh, pretty incredible. I think that's definitely going to be a good first impression and tough to beat. But other than that, I think everyone seems pretty nice. So hopefully. My first impression rose is going to go to Marissa. Will you accept the first impression rose? <laughs> I would love to. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. You know, I, I'm pretty excited when I got it. I think my mom would be proud. <laughs> he seems like a really nice guy. It's awesome to have a new experience like this and get to know more people. Um, just being so busy with hockey and stuff, I don't always get to know more people around the school. So I'm definitely enjoying that aspect. And he seems like a really nice guy, too. So she has the first impression, Rose. And she's really nice. Like, she's really outgoing. She has an uh, outgoing personality. So she's definitely one to watch, for sure. Because she's like super pretty and she seems to be having a good connection with Caleb. So I'd say she's probably a pretty, uh, pretty big threat. <laughs> Alright, so hi everyone. So this is where reality hits. Uh, I hope you guys have gotten to know each other a little bit, but we now have to go into our first rose ceremony of season two. It looks like everyone had a really fun night. It looks like some connections were starting to form as well. Unfortunately, this is a tough part, but uh, Caleb, it's in your hands now, so good luck. Yeah, I'm sorry for anyone who doesn't get a rose. Um, I feel like in our last 15 minutes together, we became 
as close as we possibly could. So um, I hope we can still be friends and um, that none of you are mad at me because I don't mean it personally. Well, it's kind of personal. But, um, so first, um, Nicole, will you accept this rose? Yes. <laughs> we can hug. We can. Um, second, Jamie, will you accept this rose? Yes, of course. Thanks. Would have been awkward if you said no. <laughs> um, Courtney, will you accept this rose? Yeah, of course. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thanks for accepting it. Oh, no problem. Rima, will you accept this rose? Yes. Sorry, thank you. That was awkward. <laughs> Daniela. And cast your connection. <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Kennedy, will you accept this rose? Thank you. For those of you who did not receive a rose, I'm sorry. Just take a moment and say your goodbyes. I'm sorry. I hope we can still be friends. Yeah. Good to see you. Like, like we are friends. So, you know. Honestly, I thought I thought you were too cool for me. Like you, you just thought seemed, I was too cool for you. Yeah, you seem like you you're like you're just you're just too cool. So. <laughs> Sorry, thanks. Thanks for the cannoli. <laughs> Find me we'll market go. tomorrow. We'll eat it. Okay. Because I don't know if I'll like it. Okay. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's okay. I wish you all the best. Yeah, we'll travel to Singapore together one day. I'd love to. Go. As friends. Uh, you know, it's too bad that it didn't work out, but any exposure is good exposure. So. Here I am. I'm not feeling too bad. This is great exposure. It's really nice to get out of my comfort zone and stuff. And plus, I'm sure I'm going to be gaining some Instagram followers soon at Irina Darling on Instagram. Hit me up. How am I going to break it to my teammates on track team? I don't know. They're really supporting me. Everyone on the team, all 40 of them, were totally excited for me to do this. And they're going to be sad because it didn't work out, but that's okay. They'll hopefully help me to find someone else out there. <laughs> Um, well, he did say that he thought I was too cool for him, which might be true. But uh, I respect his decision, and he's a really nice guy. Well, hopefully the remaining girls and Caleb can continue to juggle their emotions. Tune into next week's episode to see where Caleb's heart goes. <laughs>